ಸ ಭಗವತೋ ಅರ್ಹತೋ ಸಮ ಸಂಬುಧ ಸನ್ನಮೋತ ಸ ಭಗವತೋ ಅರ್ಹತೋ ಸಮ ಸಂಬುಧ ಸನ್ನಮೋತ ಸ ಭಗವತೋ ಅರ್ಹತೋ ಸಮ ಸಂಬುಧ ಸ The gates to the deathless are open. Let those who have ears trust in this. Aparutha de sangamathasa thavara The gates to the deathless are open. The Buddha was saying, it's here and now. Let those who have ears trust in this. Those who pay attention may enter. The Sota Wanta is the one who listens or sees, pays attention, is awake. This kind of sustained awareness, this listening, is an expansive state of mind. It is the conscious experience in the present which embraces the moment rather than discriminates as we do when we concentrate on one thing and shut out all the rest. The meaning of Pamun Chatu Sadam is to trust or to relax into this present moment with faith. It's a simple ability. It's not a complicated or difficult thing to do. It's not like you have to spend years trying to be mindful and trying to get it. It's not like that. It's a natural state that is relaxed and attentive, open, receptive, in the present. This has been my theme since I came to Amrawati, the deathless realm. So when we trust in that, then we begin to recognize the way it is. For example, in the body, the feelings, the mental states, the Dharma. These comprise the four foundations of mindfulness. And they are what is present, here and now. When we just open, and observe the way the body is in the present. That's an intuitive ability where the mind is embracing or with the way the body is. It's an intuitive awareness 
rather than a rational analysis. And so we use the four postures and the breath. The breath is like this, sitting, standing, walking, lying down, is like this. Whether you're feeling pleasure or pain, or whatever, we're just noticing, being the witness. Beginning to trust in our ability to observe the way it is, like this. We begin to take refuge in that ability of awakened awareness, of developing wisdom, listening, investigating, and watching. This deathless reality is realized through paying attention to life. We realize it. We can actually know the deathless Dharma directly through awakening our mind and paying attention to whatever is happening within us or outside us. Awareness is bringing us to a universal reality that's transcending the conditions and all the conventions. When your mind is open and you're paying attention, it doesn't have to be listening for anything in particular. It's a state, a way of being present. You can trust that listening and begin to take refuge in your ability to listen. You begin to hear yourself and all the kinds of things that go on. The complaining, the resentment, the fears, the doubts, the worries, jealousies, and the anxieties that we produce in our minds. But we no longer see any need to grasp. We no longer want to grasp them. Simply by paying attention to them, our relationship with it all changes. We are not becoming someone that's angry, discouraged, 
depressed or worried. We no longer grasp the conditions, so they drop away. They cease. They change. They dissolve in the mind. And what is left is that state of natural purity, of radiance, of silence, of infinite space. The gates to the deathless are open. We begin to take refuge in that ability of awakened awareness. Trust in this awareness. Heedlessness is the path to death. The mindful do not die. Awareness is the way out of suffering, the gate to the deathless. Trust in this awareness.